I'll be showing you step by step how to restore your products to your Shopify store. Now to note, you'll have already needed to have created a backup. This is going to be using the CSV method in Shopify that is completely free and it makes it super easy to export your products and then importing them to update the information. So let's start things off from the Shopify dashboard. Let's head to products on the left here. And to note in a previous video, I did export here for my Shopify products and I did select all products into a plain CSV file. Just do it again so we can work with up to date data. But let's say we're going through our products and we make a change. So let's say it's the frame canvas. Maybe I just change the title. Maybe I change the price to 200, 200, 200, 200, and 200. Let's hit save in the top right. Let's say I've made these changes or one person from my team has made these changes and I go and I want to restore them, except maybe I did this for quite a few products. I can use that CSV export that I previously had to go in and restore it to its previous state. So in the top right here, I can click on import. I can go and add a file. I'm going to add the latest export that I previously had. And I want it to overwrite products with matching handles. And these are existing values that are going to be replaced for all columns in the CSV file that I am uploading. So let's click upload and preview. I can see there are four products in this file with 22 SKUs and 21 images. So let's hit import products here. It's going to say we're currently importing into your store. This could take some time and it's really going to depend on how many products are in your store and that CSV file. But it is completed here because there's not too many products in this store. And if I click on framed canvas, I can see the title has been restored to test product. And if I scroll down to the price, it's all been restored to its previous values. So overall, the restoration process is pretty straightforward as you're just importing that CSV file that was exported for a backup. Now, if you're using a Shopify app, this is probably gonna be a little bit different of a process, but they should have options making that pretty simple. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. That's where our sponsor ProfitCalc comes in, the one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations so you can see how profitable you are in just one click. It's going to give you your revenue, cost of goods sold, transaction fees, all your ad spend from all your different accounts from Facebook, Google, Snapchat, Bing, Pinterest, and TikTok, as well as your transaction fees and any other monthly expenses. It's going to break everything down into an easy to understand dashboard with tons of analytics and metrics so you can start making smarter business decisions. There's a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself and you can find it in the Shopify app store by searching profit calc and then looking for this logo in the top left here. There's also a link in the description below that will bring you to the Shopify app listing. So make sure you check that out and start your 15 day free trial. So this is a short and sweet video here on how to restore your products to your Shopify store. We did so using the CSV method. If you have an export of your products that you've done for a previous backup. If this video helped at all, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.